but like I said, I just don't want to die here. In fact, yeah, no, 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 getting out. Look at my health. Ooh, I'm bleeding. I'm bleeding. Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to summer. It's Stardew Valley. Tomorrow's weather is going to be beautiful, which is fantastic. Okay, fortune teller. Spirits are somewhat mildly perturbed. Okay, we can deal with that because we're not really going to be doing any mining. Welcome to living off the land. We're back again with another tip for y'all. Now listen up. Summer's here along with a whole slew of new crops to plant. Take hops, for example. The vines take a while to grow, but once they mature, they can be harvested every day. Yeah, hops is a, is a pretty good one. So, first day of each season is going to be mostly, well, almost definitely dedicated to... Uh, so setting up your new crops, so we're quite lucky with the fact that we got some sprinklers set up and that our ground is already tilled, well, well uh, watered, not tilled. Um, but I am going to use this as a chance to uh, really sort of expand my farm. Uh, I want to be able to grow new stuff. I'm also going to be moving these sprinklers over. So basically what I want to do is I want to include this coffee bean. Um, so essentially what I'm going to be doing is... Uh, making it so that this is our end spot here and obviously a sprinkler would go in the middle uh, so really oops I'm watering it I don't want to water it uh, water this place really what I want to be doing is something along the lines of this uh, and that bit there because then we put a sprinkler in there so um, oh if we hoe oh okay I didn't realize that um, well I, obviously I knew that when you hoed ground it it took up the sprinkler, but I was just trying to destroy the sprinkler. I wasn't also trying to, uh, to, um, I wasn't also trying to hoe the ground underneath, but, yeah, basically, uh, we're going to be moving our crops over like this, and it should help us, um, to expand our field quite a bit more, so, there we go, um, and I think the sprinkler, yeah, the sprinkler would now need to go in there, let's grab those, and plonk them there, Plug them there. Uh, so Pierre isn't open just yet, which is fine by me. And, and you also, you don't have to like use the pickaxe to mine a place where you want to put the sprinkler. You can put it just directly on till dirt. But I, I find it helps me lay out where I want things to go. Um, so obviously we'll need a spot there and a spot there. And then the rest of this will be tilled. Sweet. And yeah, I am going to go one down as well because you know what? We're going to go big in summer here. Um, this area, I think I'm going to dedicate solely to... Um, <clears throat> excuse me. This area, I think I'm going to dedicate solely to, uh, like, renewable crops. Crops which you can harvest multiple times a year. That way I haven't got very far to go. Um, so I can keep an eye on them. Whereas the other section where I had the potatoes at the end of the last season, I think is going to be where I do my, like, single grow crops. Okay, so our new area is already hoed out. As you can see, we're going to need a lot more sprinklers, but that is something that is going to come in time. Um, this scarecrow can go there. I think that's good enough. Uh, obviously, we're going to need to water the, the crops before... Or we're going to need to water the plants. Um, we'll move that bee house, like, there as well, just so we've got some space. We're going to need to water them. Um, I don't think I'm going to have enough money to buy all the crops I want, so I am actually going to take a couple of like things to sell uh mainly the the strawberry jam uh because we've got some currently like brewing i guess so we need one of these for the community center but i thought i'd just sell one to get a bit of extra money if i need it that's the thing okay so we have i think 15 sprinkler spots and there's eight crops per sprinkler spot so that makes a total of 120 you know what i'm gonna accept this quest if i don't do it then i don't do it but 720 gold is quite a big chunk so what do we got we got melons these are single harvest tomato takes 11 days to mature and continues to produce after the first harvest i think um they grow every four days blueberries is going to be your main money crop um each blueberry pr plant produces three blueberries and they uh they take 13 days to grow so they take a bit of time but every four days they'll make blueberries peppers i think i'm going to go big on peppers they mature very quickly in five days um, after that, they take only three days to produce new ones. Wheat are very quick plants to grow. Um, I think I might get some wheat today as well. Uh, radishes I won't be getting. Poppy seeds I won't be getting just yet either. Spangle I think I'm going to be putting in that place as well because I need to put it near the beehive. Hops I'm definitely going to get. You can turn hops into pale ale, which gets a lot of money. 
Uh, yeah, they do take 11 days to grow, but then every single day after that, they'll produce hops. So I'm not going to get too many of those. I think I'm just going to get like six. Corn is pretty good. Um, they're expensive, but that's because you plant them in the summer and they keep, up, keep on growing through the fall, which is pretty good. I'm going to get like 10 of those because I'm going to plant them with the hops. Sunflower I am going to get, but not from here because... Um, you, sunflowers are the only seeds that if you buy them from Jojo Mart, they're actually cheaper. So that's what I'm going to be doing. Uh, so I'm going to get uh, two sprinklers worth of pepper seeds. Um, summer Spangle. I think I'm going to get two sprinkler worth of that as well. We're going to need to grow these because these are Caroline's favorite presents. So we'll get some of those. Uh, I've got corn. I've got... <clears throat> I need tomatoes. I think I'll just get one sprinkler worth of those. You don't really need too many of these, and they grow pretty quickly, I think. Um, have I got everything I need? Let's just check. In terms of sprinkler, uh, I want two sprinklers dedicated to coffee beans, which will get sorted quite soon, so that's at least 13. So we've got two sprinklers worth here. Uh, two here, two here, so that makes six. Seven. So... We've got seven sprinklers worth, and we need 13. That means we need eight sprinklers worth of uh, blueberries, which would make 48, because it's seven times eight. No, that, that's not right. That's not right at all. Was it six? I think it's... I think we need 48 blueberries. I think that's what I'm going to go with, because I think it's six sprinklers worth. So let's sell enough stuff so that we've got enough money. That leaves us with 30 strawberries. That's definitely going to be enough, I think. All right, 48. Let's go with that and see how well we do. Um, if you've got enough money, I do recommend you use Speed Grow on the blueberries because it gives you that one extra harvest. If you plant it on the first day, you'll be able to do an extra harvest on the very last day of summer. I don't have enough money um, to get that set up today, which is a bit unfortunate, so I am not going to be doing it. Now, in terms of, um, actually, I'll tell you what, I'm going to water it while I can. In terms of quality fertilizer, the majority of, or well, no, the pale ale, or the hops you're going to be growing, um, is going to be turned into pale ale, which uh, doesn't benefit from uh, quality. So I'm not going to bother with quality fertilizer on, on, the, um, on the hops, which is along the top there. Uh, I think I will bother with corn, because corn is one of the quality crops which you can um, submit to the community center, so um, I think I will bother with those. I, I'm not sure if it's worth doing it with blueberries or not. The, the reason for that is that the blueberries... Um, oh, I'm out of water. <laughs> the blueberries, when you, when you harvest blueberries, three blueberries pop off a plant. The only one that can be affected by quality is the first one, and the other two will always be normal quality, if that makes sense. So, out of the three blueberries, one of them has a chance of being silver or gold, but the other two will always be normal. Um, so I think I'm not going to bother with blueberries, because if I had enough quality for, or had enough fertilizer to go around my entire crops, then I would. Uh, but for starters, I think hops I'm going to put right at the top here, that way they're not really blocking anything off. Um, and they're getting watered as well, which is fine. Uh, so yeah, because I'm not putting quality fertilizer down or, or basic fertilizer down on them, then I'm not that bothered. Um, like I said, the corn I think I will bother with. Uh, so we'll put the fertilizer down here because the corn and the... Uh, oops, must add before planting. Oops. Uh, yeah, the corn and the hops are sharing the sprinklers here because... You don't need too many corn for what we want to do, so that's fine. Um, right, Summer Spangle. I think I'm definitely going to fertilize that because, like I said, they're, they're Caroline's favorite present. Um, so we definitely want some high-quality ones of those. Uh, plus, I'm going to keep some by the bees uh, just in case. Well, not just in case. I'm going to keep them by the bees so that the bees' honey will uh, be better quality. Oh, no! Oh, that is going to throw up my, or throw up, that's going to throw off my OCD, so I'm going to have to do, I'm going to have to do that. Uh, hot peppers as well, I think I'm going to fertilize those. Um, uh, they are the favorite gift of both Shane and Mayor Lewis, so definitely want to get lots of those. Um, and the fact that we can harvest these, like, I think eight times in a season, means there's, there's like a hundred and... 
20 odd harvests here, so should be getting lots. Uh, what else we got? Tomatoes. Um, I guess I can quality fertilize the tomatoes, which I think I'm going to plant down here. Okay, let's just quickly water these spots. Fantastic. Okay, so yeah, let's do that. Like so. Oop, there we go. And plant the tomatoes. Again, we don't need too many tomatoes. Um, oh, no. <laughs> I keep, like, nudging my control stick. Ugh. Right, so... Oops. So I need to get one more tomato. And I need to get one more summer spangle. Um... Over here, I think I'm going to start planting some blueberries. Uh, so, actually, I think... Not blueberries. Um, sunflowers. So, I think for now, I will actually fertilize that. And the rest over here, I'm just going to randomly fertilize for the blueberries. I think I've got enough here to last for three... Um, for three... Um, not quite three sprinklers worth. But, I did my maths right. And we've got just enough blueberries to plant in this spot here because we got 48 which is six sprinkles worth so yeah i did my maths right which is great plant all these and then i'm going to go grab some uh, sunflower seeds another summer spangle and another tomato which is oh i can't believe i did that oh it's 4 30 p.m i'm not going to get there in time uh-oh this could be bad i didn't realize oh no am i gonna have to buy them from jojo instead <clears throat> excuse me I'm going to have to buy them from Jojo instead. Well, that sucks. 5 p.m. Pierre is closed for the day. Dun, dun, dun. I can't believe that. Pierre, no, come back. So, Jojo is going to eat a little bit of our profit here. Which kind of stinks, but we're making it, uh, making up for it. That's the way I'm, I'm going to like to think of this. We're going to make up for it by, um, by getting a, a cheaper deal on sunflower seeds. Um, so, I want... Um, three sunflower seeds. I actually think I might get a little bit of wheat. Because that only takes four days to grow. Um, but I need quite a bit of wheat. But it's quite cheap. I don't know. I need a tomato. I need a summer spangle. Can't believe I did that. <laughs> wheat is, like I said, quite quick to grow. But, no, I think I'm going to ignore it. Spent too much money here at Joja. <laughs> yeah, the, uh, the only way you, uh, Joja is a bad thing is if you buy the membership. In my opinion, anyway. Okay, like I said, there's multiple ways to play this game. I need to do some foraging. Oh my goodness, I would like to do some fishing today as well, since we got a little bit of extra energy. I still can't believe I misclicked these couple of spots, and I don't even have OCD. I just like things being neat. Tomato there, and the sunflowers, I'm going to plant there. So sunflowers are interesting. Also, I'm, I'm going to spend the rest of the day fishing. Yeah, the reason why sunflowers... Ooh. Oh, you see, look at this. More strawberry jam already. The reason why sunflowers are interesting is because when you harvest them, they also give... Or they have the, the option of giving you one to three seeds. Um, so uh, the actual sunflowers themselves sell for a loss. I think um, they cost 125 from Joja, but the sunflower themselves... Uh, I think you sell them for 80 at their base price. I can't remember the exact number. <clears throat> but if I'm right, I'm right. If I'm wrong, I'm wrong. Um, so, basically, the idea is you plant the seeds which you get from uh, from uh, harvesting the sunflowers. And then, obviously, that makes more sunflowers. Ideally, it would be nice uh, if we can get enough to give to Haley, Because... Um, yeah, they they are her fa one of her favorite gifts, and this is the earliest we can get something like that. Now, I think I might be able... Oops, definitely can't reach it from there. Uh, I think I can reach the uh, the black from here. No, I really can't. Yeah, so it would be nice if we can get some some gold star um, sunflowers for Haley, but I, I don't think we're going to get enough in summer, which is fine. As long as we've got enough to last her a little bit, we can still uh, get her other crops or stuff later on. Okay, so doing some fishing, of course, it's a new season. Actually, the one fish that I came to get from here, I can't. Hmm, that's a shame because it's it's too late now. Um, there's a specific fish that shows up during the daytime, and I can't get it anymore because it's too late. It stops showing up at 7 p.m. But at least we're getting a little bit of money. I mean, I sold too many strawberries, but yeah, at least we're getting a little bit of money. There is a fish, actually, that's quite rare mm -hmm. that shows up here um, mm -hmm. 
during the summer. It's quite difficult to catch as well, and it's available all day, so maybe I'll run into it. I doubt I'll be so lucky, though, but look at how easily we catch fish now. Like, do we have the original rod? No, we don't. That's only useful for adding a spinner to it. But yeah, it's uh, our fishing bar is pretty high, so pretty pleased with that. All right, I'll tell you what, I'm going to cut here. Oh, a can of Joja Cola. Mmm, my favorite. Yeah, I'm going to cut here, and I will see you guys if I get anything interesting, which probably isn't going to happen. Oh, this could potentially be it, but I don't think I'm going to catch it here, actually. It's being a bit of a butt. Uh, it's pretty difficult to catch. Oh, uh, I think I'm going to lose it. I'm going to lose it. Okay, okay. Fight back, fight back, fight back. Bring it on. Come on, you are mine. And if I'm correct, this will be caught soon. <laughs> Oh, it's, yeah, it is a pike. Yeah, that's the fish I was after. It's a pike. Apparently it didn't say new record, though. Um, I actually only need one of these, because it's not used for any bundles, and I just need to sell it and ship it and have it as part of my collection, which is great. We've done that. So, yeah, pretty happy with that. Actually, it's 11 p.m. now. I'm going to catch whatever this fish is and then head on home. Haven't had any treasure chests uh, while I've been fishing, which kind of stinks, but oh well. It's another chub. Let's head on home. And it was a gold star pike as well. That's fantastic. All right, let's just sell all this. I don't care. The wood I will keep. I need to I need to start getting more chests out because you know, it would be nice to have more. Need more acorns as well, but it's fine. Yeah, this season I definitely want to get my... Uh, hi, Jackson. Good good boy. Yeah, this season I definitely want to get my, um, my, my tree tapper farm set up. 290 from selling that jam, which is pretty good. Pike was worth 187. Mm, not bad for just one fish, I guess. Yeah, we got a little bit of money, not too much. Hopefully, hopefully we've got good spirits today, because I need to get more gold for the sprinkler system. Be fantastic. In fact, I should check and make sure that I've got enough of the other ores um, to make enough sprinklers. I think I need seven in total. Yeah, <laughs> we need a lot. Um, so let's take a look. Okay, it's going to be a beautiful sunny day. That's fine. And spirits feel a little neutral. <clears throat> That's fine. I can deal with that. There we go. Sprinkler starting the day off right. Fantastic. So the other thing is, of course, if you don't have plants, or if you don't have crops planted on... Wait, did these tomatoes actually grow a stage yesterday? I don't think they did. That would suck. But yeah, at least we don't have a lot of watering to do, which would also suck. <laughs> We're out of water. Um, obviously, once we get our our non-renewable crops area set up to the left where the potatoes were, there's still a lot of plants to water. But hopefully by then I'll have enough sprinklers. Uh, the only crop which I need to grow there in bulk, I think, are melons because they are Penny's favorite gift. And so we're going to need like 33 of them. I think I worked out that one episode. Hey, Jackson, you come for a pet? Good boy. You know what? I'm going to fill up your water bowl today. Yeah, because I'm a good adopter like that, because we technically adopted you. And I hope my scarecrows are placed effectively enough. If not, then we could lose some crops. But look at that. We are all watered by 7.30. How fantastic is that? Oh, except for the, uh, except for the coffee bean here. Uh, I look back at some footage, and I think the coffee bean is going to start producing... Or I think the coffee plant is going to start producing beans next episode which will be great. Okay, so, seven sprinklers, we need seven refined quartz, we need seven iron ore, or seven iron bars. Oh, no, so I need one more quartz, isn't it? Yeah. So one of those, and then, oh, uh, excuse me, uh, excuse me. Oh, was it trying to put it in the shipping box? That was weird. All right, there we go. Let's get rid of the things that I don't need. Uh, so I don't need the ax, don't need those, don't need the fishing rod. And let's see if we can have a decent mining trip today. Um, I'm kind of tempted to go and uh, go and forage because I do need to get the foraging stuff. Oh, we got more maple syrup. Hmm. Do I turn that? Mm, you know what? I, I think I'm gonna. I think I'm gonna keep that for now. Um, I don't want to turn it into a beehive just yet, but I also need pine tar because we need to sell like one of each of these in order for it to show up in our collections. So. That kind of stinks, but at the same time, kind of understandable. Should I really go mining without food? It'll be fine. Look, I've got a spice berry. Mmm, 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 delicious. 
They gave me actually quite a bit of energy, 25. <laughs> Alright, so really, I'm only going to go in here to get a little bit more gold. Hello, Shadow Brute. Just turning up right as I walk in. And you drop the, the way down straight away. I'm going to check and make sure there's no uh, gold around first, because that's why I'm here. Obviously wouldn't mind, uh, wouldn't mind making progress quickly, but doesn't look like there's any gold. So, you know what, stay back, slime. That, I wasn't staying back. So we'll just go straight down again. Look at how much health we lost. Like, pretty immediately. It's fine. Like I said, here for gold, and gold only. Obviously, now that we've got gold, we can start upgrading some tools to gold. But I think the best use of my time upgrading tools is going to be the watering can. Obviously, like, for now, we're trying to go for sprinklers, and we've already got enough gold for almost two sprinklers, which is pretty great. Aquamarine there. Oh, yeah, the gem double ability thing we got last time. That's pretty good. There's a bat coming. Okay, looks like we're going to have to smack some rocks to make our way down. Oh, come on, hurry up. Unless this bat has the uh, has the exit. Nope, I should be so lucky. Um, yeah, the, the tool which I want to upgrade next is definitely going to be the watering can. So once I have enough sprinklers, um, I can safely upgrade my watering can, which will be happy days. More gold over here. More happy days. Okay. Break that. And I now have ten gold. That's enough for two more sprinklers. Fantastic. Let's see if there's any more gold around here, because that's the reason why I've come down here. Okay. You know what? I'm probably going to cut out a little bit on mining here, because it's going to be a little bit repetitive. I'm just going to try and get gold and, and, and get some more sprinklers. So I'll see you guys in a bit. So this could be bad. We're getting infested. And I'm pretty low on health, so I want to make sure I'm near the ladder, just in case I get swarmed here. We've got 15 gold, which is enough for two sprinklers. So I'm think, oh sorry, three sprinklers. So I'm thinking I may just cut it quits here. We're pretty low on energy as well, so probably not going to be able to break through enough rocks to make it to floor 90. Like for for a neutral luck day, it's not been too bad. But like I said, I just don't want to die here. In fact, yeah, no, 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 getting out. Look at my health. Ooh, I'm bleeding. <laughs> I'm bleeding. Um, it wasn't it wasn't too bad, but it wasn't fantastic. Plus, it le means that I've got enough time to uh, to to gather some foraging. Maybe do the fishing that I wanted to, or get the thing that I wanted to yesterday. Um, at least I'm. Oh my goodness. Okay, I'm gonna have to. I'm gonna have to get these chests sorted out a little bit differently. Okay, so we've got enough, uh, oh, we got some, oh, we haven't got enough gold there, it was fine. Uh, oh, we're, we're out of copper, well, we're out of coal, even. Um, okay. oh my god, I don't know why it keeps doing that. Uh, so we've got enough materials out of that lot. Um, oh, but I am going to have to actually smelt some copper. If I want to upgrade my watering can to copper, I'm going to need more copper. So I might have to go and do a little bit of uh, digging up there. Oh, that's Batwing. Oh, these things do not go in this chest. Okay. just I'm, I'm just too used to throwing them in there now. Ooh, that, um, that health bar is going to annoy me. Not going to lie. I need to do something about that. Can I eat some... It's going to have to be strawberries, isn't it? Let's just eat some strawberries because we've run out of um, salmon berries now, which is a shame. Uh, that will at least put our health and our energy back up. You know what? I think I am going to go fishing for that rare fish uh, in the river again. Uh, because at least it means there's one less fish for me to... Tr you know what? Let's just do it. Get our health all the way up because otherwise it will annoy me. Um, yeah, at least it's one less fish for us to try and catch. It's not a hugely great use of our time, but it means that... Um, it means that it will allow the sprinklers or the, the gold here to, uh, to settle. Settle? Smelt. There we go. Um, while I'm out doing that. Oh, artifact worm. Definitely want to focus on these again. That's why I brought my, uh, hoe with me. Uh, oh great, stone. <laughs> so worth it. Yeah. Okay, so time to do a little bit more fishing. Hopefully before seven I can catch that fish. It's the only one really that appears in this part of the river, so, like I said, hopefully I'll be able to get it. And, um, check in with you guys once I have a bit of progress for you. Progress. There we go. I can say word. Hi, Elliot. Wish I had a present for you. I need to um, need to get some some bait boxes down by the ocean um, because I didn't realize that I'm actually going to need them in order to complete stuff. So yeah, plus they give one of Elliot's favorite gifts. So that's pretty handy. Let's see if I get lucky and get the fish that I'm after the first time. 
and rainbow trap. Well, that's a new one, but it's not the one I'm after. <clears throat> this guy is the next fish, and he is quite a feisty little guy. See, he, he like twitches a lot. I'm hoping this is the rare one, which I'm I want to get. It's not really rare. It's just um, I don't know. Is it rare? Probably not. It's just got some different times, and it's another pike. That's fine. It sells for a bit. Never mind. So it's nearly seven o'clock here. Still haven't caught the fish that I'm after. Um, every like feisty fish I've caught has been a pike. I think I've got like five or six of them now. Uh, so after seven, it won't appear, which is oh, I thought that was it. Another rainbow trout. I think I need two of those anyway. Uh, so yeah, that's fine. I can sell one, keep one for later. Uh, they're not used for any bundle, the, the pike and the rainbow trout, but uh, I do need one. Uh, oh, oh, it just hit seven, so this isn't going to be the fish I'm after. That's a shame. I think I'm going to have to dedicate like an entire day to uh, to looking for this particular fish, which is a bit of a shame, but whatever. Anyway, let's head back to the farm to sell these. And I think for the rest of the day, because it's still quite early, I might go around and see who I can gift to. Uh, I don't really know yet. Maybe I'll do that. Maybe I'll do something else. Do maybe a little bit more gold searching. Gold digging um, might be useful. Well, it's definitely going to be useful. But hopefully the gold over here has finished smelting because that way we can uh, we can keep it. Keep it? Or we can just turn them into sprinklers. Jeez. Uh, so I am going to quickly make a chest. Uh, and the reason for that is I'm actually going to keep it in the, the house here. Um, and I'm going to keep here a sunfish and one of the rainbow trouts because I need those for a particular uh, cooking recipe. Um, so there's, you know, you have to cook everything in this game as well if you want to complete it like the way I want to complete it. So I did sell everything I need to sell, right? I hope I, hope I did. All right, let's take these out, make some more quality sprinklers. What do the normal sprinklers take? Copper bar and iron bar. Eh, not really worth it, in my opinion. <clears throat> uh, so I think I'm going to place one. You know what? I might as well finish this top row here and put that one there as well. Good boy, Jackson. Oh, I've already petted you. Oh, and I filled up your, your dog bowl, didn't I? Okay, let's put those back and the stone as well. Um, okay, let's think. If we're going to uh, go to the, the saloon, who might be there? Evelyn won't be. You might be. Uh, I'll take a jade. I'll take a diamond as well, because I might give that to Marnie if she's there. An aquamarine, an emerald. Uh, a strange bun, because if Shane's there, he can have that. And a topaz as well for Clint, maybe. Uh, yeah, let's just go ahead with that. I don't think Haley ever turns up to the uh, to the saloon, so I won't bother taking a daffodil. Ooh, I need to check birthdays. Yes, I do. I'll do that quickly on the way to the saloon here. You can actually buy a calendar for you to keep in your house, so you can make uh, checking dates uh, quite easy, I guess. Uh, but let's check here. Jazz's birthday, second day, next episode. I don't have anything that she likes. <laughs> uh, she might like daffodils, but I don't know. Um, Shane, you like strange buns? No, I don't want to eat it. Why are you giving me your garbage? I could have sworn you like strange buns. Has that knocked us down a happiness level? I think it did. Oh. Oh, that's bad. I thought he liked strange buns. He clearly doesn't. I have a topaz. This is exactly what I'm looking for. I know. Um, Emily? Emerald. Boop. That's a fabulous gift. You are welcome. Let's see if I can find Sebastian, because I know he sometimes comes here. If not, he might be outside by the lake. Uh, it doesn't look like he's here. Um, there's a fish I have to catch at the lake, but it only appears before 7 p.m. Ooh, some green algae. Ooh, a soggy newspaper. Just the things I were looking for. All right, let's just head up here. I think we can go this way, can't we? Is there, like, steps? Yeah, there is. Cool. Let's see if we can find Sebastian. If not, eh. I might quickly do a quick foraging look around since it's the end of the day here, see what I can get. I don't think I'm going to bother with the mines. We've only got like two or three hours left. There goes Sebastian. I wonder if I can catch up with him quickly. Ah, oh, are you kidding me? Are you kidding me? Oh, oh well. <laughs> you win some, you lose some. Sometimes he likes to stay out here in the in the rain, or in the the or at night time, so I was hoping he would be here, but he is not. 
Okay, so we've got the spice berry already um, for the foraging bundle. Oh, you know what I haven't checked in a while? I haven't checked our fruit cave. Uh, I'll probably do that at the beginning of the next episode. Or since I'm going there now, I might as well do it now. There's another spice berry there. We can at least sell that. Um, yeah, I'm gonna I'm gonna definitely check the fruit cave. Oh oh oh! I did see the wiggly worms. Uh, you are not gonna escape. Oh, it's another lost book. I should probably explain these lost books at some point, but basically they just open up some books in the library for you to read, if you're so inclined. Um, but they're not, nothing too special. Ooh, a couple of spice berries, but we've got an orange here, that's Gus's favourite gift. And a blackberry, I think we need a blackberry for the community centre. But we also need an orange, ooh. Ooh, but we are growing an orange tree. I think I'm going to keep these. Definitely going to keep those. Oh, we got a silver blackberry as well. Um, these I'm just going to sell, because whatever. Uh, the other things I'm going to put back in the chest. Save them for another day. I've got a little bit of time. So I think I'm going to do a little bit of exploring. Uh, just seeing what foraging gifts I can find. See if there's anything for anybody. Uh, I don't want to take too, too much time to do this, because otherwise we might not get back in time and have a really big energy deficit. In fact, I probably shouldn't have come out here at all, because it is getting late after all. Uh, let's just see what I can find. I want to open up a, a lockable area at some point this season. Yeah, I don't think we're going to find anything. There's another spice berry there. I think I'll leave it. Just to do a lap of the, the lake here, the pond. If there's anything, then I'll grab it, but it doesn't look like there's anything worth grabbing. Well, that was a waste of time, wasn't it? Oh well, let's head back to bed. Um, we're probably going to get a small energy penalty. Uh, I don't know, I might get back before 1am. But other than that, it's been a fairly uneventful day. Um, the beginning of the seasons can be quite slow because you're sort of waiting for your first crops to come in so that you can sell them and get more money to buy more crops. So really, I fill it up with fishing to get money. Yeah, there's 1am, dang it. So we're going to get a little bit of money from fishing, but not too much. Anyway, let's see how much money we got today. Probably like a thousand... Not too much, I wouldn't say. I don't know, we got four pikes. Oh, hello. What's this? Level 7 fishing. That took a very long time. <laughs> Alright, let's see what money we get. Hardly any from foraging. Yeah, look at that, exactly a thousand, pretty much. So, thank you all very much for watching. Join me next time in Stardew Valley, when we will continue the beginning of summer, and see what goodies we can get. Alright, thanks again, and I'll see you then. Bye-bye.